Big developments in the city of Florence tonight. Another top city official is fired. Plus, new calls from citizens for a criminal investigation by the state. Good evening, I'm Mallory Anderson. And I'm Bart Bedsole. We begin with breaking news at 10 o'clock. City leaders in Florence calling in the Colorado Bureau of Investigation and firing the city attorney. The bold action comes days after 13 investigates uncovered a city hall sexual harassment scandal and missing taxpayer money. Chief investigative reporter Chelsea Brenzel first brought the problems to light. She's live in Florence with this major update in our investigation, Position of Power. Chelsea. Martin Mallory, after 13 investigates exposed the City Hall sex harassment scandal exactly a week ago, tonight the council decided to unanimously vote to fire their city attorney. And mounting pressure from frustrated taxpayers prompted Councilman Brian Allen to tell the chief of police to call in the Colorado Bureau of Investigation to look into missing city money first uncovered by 13 investigates. Florence is not above the law. We, the people, are insisting on an investigation into the city. What I find kind of disturbing is it took an outside reporter to come here and calculate stuff and come up that you are missing money. And what bothers me is it took her to come in here and find all this stuff in a short amount of time. And we don't know where what else is missing. After demands for accountability from its citizens, major action from the Florence City Council. So tonight I would like to make the motion that we terminate Matt Cobb as our city attorney. Direct our police department to please contact CBI. A round of applause from citizens who have been pushing for answers on Florence City finances for years with calls for transparency going unanswered. 13 investigates found tens of thousands of taxpayer dollars were used to provide city executives interest-free loans for personal housework and cars from 2013 to 2018. According to the city, around $2,000 from that account is unaccounted for. There was a lot of people that were right, and there was a lot of people that were wrong. Amen. I'd like to thank Chelsea for all your help. Because we, I, some of the stuff I haven't, I've never, I've never seen. The chief of police is expected to call in the CBI for an investigation tomorrow. Fired city attorney Matt Crobb had no comment on his termination. You can count on our team to continue to update you on this developing story. For now, reporting live at Florence City Hall, Chelsea Brenzel, 13 Investigates. All right, big update there, Chelsea. Thanks.